I found Lake Lion Mall Cave, also known as Lake Lion Cave in Cedar Park, Texas. This cave is located inside the Lake Lion Research Preserve, or the Lake Lion Cave Research Preserve. What I'm going to be doing is show you guys the inside, the inside of the entrance to Lake Lion Cave. I'm going to be explaining some of the geology and wildlife as well. So let's get, so let's go inside. The cave entrance is about 15 to 20 feet deep, so I'm going to be going down there very carefully. I'm going to be showing you guys the inside. There, there appears to be a sense of humidity and moisture inside of this cave. And you see a bunch of mosquitoes flying around. But not too many. I won't be exploring the full inside of the cave because the cave is too narrow for me to crawl through. So, yeah, most of this is all limestone. Hard rock and limestone. And possibly clay deposits. As you see, the, the entry is too narrow for me to crawl through, so I'm going to shoot from the outside instead and pan my camera around at various angles. You can feel a sense of humidity and moisture as you go deeper down inside of this cave. I'm going to be shooting from outside the cave real soon so you guys can see what the outside looks like since you already seen me going inside the cave. As you see here there are tree branches growing out to the north of the perimeter of the rim to this cave. Yeah that's what these are, tree branches. I'm going to climb back out real soon but before I do that I'm going to make sure I got every aspect of this cave. There are a bunch of more mosquitoes that there are a bunch of more mosquitoes for as you go farther down inside of this cave. Again, this is only in the entrance of this cave. The crawlway is too narrow for me to navigate or crawl through. So I'm gonna be getting back out soon. As you see here, moss grows on the south entrance. As you see here, moss grows on the south side to the entrance of this cave. So I'm gonna go back out. Alrighty, here we go. And that is me crawling from the inside of the cave. As you see here, the cave has not been gated since 2002. The city of Austin acquired this land from the city of Cedar Park in the year 2000. There was a gate here, but that gate has been since removed, as I said a few seconds ago. Now the cave, now the shape to the entrance of Lake Line Cave is shaped into the, the design of a doorknob. The geology of this cave is limestone and clay. Now these tree branches weren't here when the cave was originally discovered by Bill Russell in 1984. And it certainly wasn't here when the city of Boston gated off this cave in 1996 after vandals started a fire here.
we are at another entrance to Lake Line Cave, also known as Lake Line Mall Cave. Now this is the gated entrance that I could not get into last time. Now, th now this cave connects to the same cave uh, as I explored in the Lake Line Research Preserve. Yes, this cave connects to that cave. As you see here, a gate has been installed. This gate is made out of iron. You see the chain link right here. Part, part of this cave has been filled in to keep out vandals and unwanted visitors. Let's we'll see if I can visit the cave though. Yeah, they welded this cave shut pretty tight. Now some of the some of the wildlife that lives inside these caves are ants. As you see here on this rock. And the cave I am exploring is called Lake Line Cave. But I seem to have found an animal crawl hole through this cave. Let's see if I can get most of this cave. I'm not going to stick my hand all the way through there because this, I don't want to lose my camera and it just keeps going darker and darker as I go farther and farther with this camera. That's as far as I can go inside this cave, I'm afraid to say.